Hey there, Explorers! Welcome to Kids World Explorers, your go-to channel for fun, science, and amazing adventures. Today, we're going on the most epic journey ever, all the way through space. That's right, we're going to travel through the solar system, discover how astronauts live in space, and unravel some of the biggest mysteries of the universe. Are you ready for the ride of a lifetime? Let's blast off! First, let's zoom out from Earth and take a look at our solar system. It's like a big neighborhood of planets, moons, and stars all moving around the sun. But did you know that the sun is actually a giant star? Let me show you where our adventure begins. Here we go. The sun is at the center of the solar system and all eight planets orbit it. But wait, before we talk about the planets, let's make sure you know what the solar system really is. It's made up of the sun, planets, moons, asteroids, comets, and dwarf planets all moving in space together. Let's start with the planets. Our first stop is Mercury, the closest planet to the sun. It's so hot there, about 800 degrees Fahrenheit during the day, but super cold at night. Next, we've got Venus, the hottest planet in the solar system with temperatures that could melt lead. Now, let's head over to Earth, our home planet. It's the only place we know where life exists thanks to the perfect mix of oxygen, water, and temperature. Isn't it amazing? Next up is Mars, the red planet. Scientists think there might have been water there in the past. It could have even had life. Who knows, maybe one day humans will visit or even live there. Then we travel to the giant planets, Jupiter and Saturn. Jupiter is so big it could fit 1,300 Earths inside it. And Saturn? It's got those beautiful rings made of ice and dust particles. Uranus and Neptune are the last two planets in our solar system. They're cold, blue, and made of gas. Uranus even spins sideways. Can you imagine rolling around like that? So the solar system is full of surprises. But now, let's take a detour. We're leaving our planets behind and heading into outer space. Let's talk about what it's like to live in space. Ever wondered how astronauts eat, sleep, or even go to the bathroom while floating in space? It's pretty wild. First, astronauts live on space stations, like the International Space Station, or ISS, that orbits Earth. They have to wear special suits and helmets to breathe and stay safe. Their suits are like mini spacecrafts that protect them from space's extreme temperatures and radiation. Now, what about eating? You might think astronauts eat fancy space food, right? Well, they actually eat food in pouches, like freeze-dried meals, and they drink liquids through special straws to avoid spills. And don't even get me started on going to the bathroom. They use special space toilets that use air suction to keep everything in place. But space isn't all about food and toilet time. Astronauts have to exercise to stay healthy. In space, there's no gravity to keep their muscles and bones strong, so they work out for about two hours every day. And guess what? They sleep in a sleeping bag strapped to the wall. No comfy beds for astronauts. They float while they sleep, so they have to keep themselves from drifting all over the place. Now that we've traveled through the solar system and seen what astronauts do in space, it's time to explore the big questions about the universe. There are so many mysteries we still don't know the answers to. First mystery, what's a black hole? Black holes are super strange. They suck in everything around them, even light. That means nothing can escape. Scientists think there's one at the center of every galaxy. Cool, right? And how about dark matter? It makes up most of the universe, but we can't see it. We only know it exists because of how it affects other things in space. It's like the invisible force that's holding everything together. Another big mystery is the possibility of life on other planets. With so many planets out there, could there be aliens? Scientists are looking for signs of life in places like Mars, Europa, one of Jupiter's moons, and even distant planets outside our solar system. Who knows? Maybe we're not alone in the universe after all. Lastly, let's talk about the Big Bang. Around 13.8 billion years ago, the universe started with a huge explosion, the Big Bang. From that tiny point, the universe has been expanding ever since, and we're still trying to understand how everything began. So explorers, we've had quite a journey today, from the planets in our solar system to the mysteries of space. But remember, Space is full of surprises, and we're just scratching the surface. There's always more to learn and discover. 
If you want to keep exploring, hit that subscribe button and don't forget to ring the bell so you won't miss any of our fun adventures. Thanks for joining me today. I'll see you next time, explorers, when we embark on even more awesome adventures. Until then, keep looking up at the stars and never stop exploring.